Hello, welcome once again to Amastech. So in this video, I'll be introducing you to Trust Wallet Smart Contract Scam and also how to revoke or access to your Trust Wallet account. Yes, yeah, there are actually a lot of scam activities or fraud activities going on Trust Wallet. And yes, you have to make sure you become aware of these scams or fraud activities so that you don't end up following these people and then losing your money, which might leave you in a depression state. So yes, I've been a victim of these trust wallet scams and it's good that I have been a victim so that you don't also become a victim, right? Me personally, I'm not surprised of this particular scam because I know how the Ponzi scheme works, everything on the internet, especially when it comes to making money online, okay? You see, I created this particular video explaining what you have to know about money making websites. You can go and check it out for more details. Yes, and if you're active on my channel, you see recently I created a video on Trust Wallet Smart Contracts, how to get 3% daily, you know, income on your deposited account in the Trust Wallet. And yes, you can see that in under the description, I stated disclaimer because, because I knew that it's, it was too risky because you want to earn money and they are also doing that to earn money. Yes, so actually in this video, I'll be showing a scam how someone got access to my trust wallet account and then transferred some amount of USDT into an unknown address, right? Yes, I'll be showing you in this particular video, okay? All because those people have access to my trust wallet because I entered the smart contract call, okay? I accepted it and then yes, I gave them access to my... I remember last year I was a victim of trust wallet watch only account yes watch only account there is, some people will just send you an address whenever you input the address or wallet it's like someone's account and they just have access to the overview or let me say the receipt of the account so they will just send you the the link and, and when you put the link in your trust wallet account the money actually comes there but you can't do anything with the money all you can do is just watch the money but they will persuade you that send this particular amount and then they will teach you or they will give you a login or something for you to be able to withdraw the money. And yes, I remember I started even planning on the things that I'll buy even before I had access to that one because it was too huge. So I didn't even hesitate. I just, man, the money that was on me, you know, I just, because they requested for it, I just send them the money and then boom, the money didn't come back. I didn't get any logins yes and they created a group okay so they were just posting you know proofs and stuff i mean it was all scam and there was no way i could get my money back right and because and then after that happened that's where i came back here on youtube to search for those scam activities on the trust wallet and i realized it was a total scam so yeah anytime someone introduces you to money making website just make sure you go to youtube and see if you can find a video on that particular website and you look at the views of people okay and again who is.com yes and trust pirate to check the when or the whereabouts of those websites right so yes this particular video is basically about how to revoke access to your trust wallet account how to revoke access to it and otherwise whenever you save money in your trust wallet you see that your money is reducing slowly or gradually and yes you wouldn't know where it goes but people have access to your account that's why your money is being missing like on your trust wallet account so make sure you watch this particular video to the end because i'll be sending you to my phone and show you how the smart contract fraud or scam works okay what you have to know what you have to be aware and then how to importantly revoke access to account okay so that you protect your trust wallet account and then you can go ahead and deposit money See, the reason why I don't like making video about Ponzi scam because most of you don't have idea about how it works, okay? Me personally, if I lose money in a Ponzi scam website, I wouldn't be that worried because I know that I was willing to lose that particular money because you want to earn money and also you should be willing to lose that particular money, right? If you're not willing to lose it, then I beg, don't go and borrow money somewhere and come and put it in a website that you don't even know where they are, you know? So yeah, you have to be aware of all these online scams, money making scams. There are actually a lot of legit ways to make money online, but I realize most of you want it quick because those legit ways, they, it mostly takes time, okay? 
and most of you don't like it you just want within two days within seconds 24 hours which is not always possible so always you get yourself being a victim okay so make sure you watch the video i created on money making websites and then i know you get something from it all right so let's go to my phone and let me teach you or introduce you to the smart contracts on the trust wallet the scam how people are being frauded and also how to revoke every access to your trust wallet All right, so in this video, I'll be introducing you to the Trust Wallet Smart Contract Scam, how it actually works, okay? And also how to revoke the access. If you want to revoke the access, you can just go straight to the chapter that you see on your screen, right? But if you want to know more about how the scam works, just stay tuned and let's continue. So you can see I have 4.49 BNB in my account, okay? And you can see after refreshing, it has come to 4.60. So sometimes you can actually get profit on your bnb if it increases so you can see the person was able to withdraw only my usdt because that's what the person has access to you can see when i'm revoking the access you will see that they've written limited in a situation where you see unlimited meaning they can withdraw any amount from your trust wallet account yes so you can see the minus 5.23 usdt that's what the person withdrew from my usdt that's the bp because that's the token that i allow the smart contract on yes so they had access to it okay but for the 15 usdt i transferred it to myself so you have to take note of the transfer that's the address okay all these are my own transactions but the first one which is minus 5.23 usdt it was actually stolen from my trust wallet account so i want you to take note of the address the ending of the address because when i'm revoking you see that these people the address that's the one they used to you know redraw the money from my account yes you can see now i have zero usdt in my usdt that's the b bep 20 right it was actually 5.23 but they withdrew it from my account and so yes i have to teach you how it works okay so before you be able to revoke anything you have to have some amount of bnb into your trust wallet account even if you are sending money whatever thing you're doing you have to have some amount of bnb into your account and the lucky thing was the assets they had on my account is limited okay and if it was unlimited they would have been able to you know withdraw everything from my account so i want you to take note of this address and also take note of the one i you know redo the 15 years because that i redo it to my binance account so i'll show you the address for you to see my binance account when you are joining the smart contract call they will let you go to the browser part of your trust wallet and let you paste or copy this particular link in the browser and then when you go they will tell you to you know click on the receive okay when you click on receive meaning you are get or let them gain access to your wallet okay that's how that's what i did and they were able to get access to my trust wallet and yes they were able to draw the money from my account so whenever you click on receive you can see here smart contract call okay actually before i was joining there was some you know warning okay there was some warning when you click on confirm you actually see a lot of warnings about how risky it is okay so anytime you click on that receive button that receive button means you are giving them access if you're unlucky and the access is unlimited then they will do every money that you have so you can see when i was approved you can see high risk address meaning the address is risky and i just went ahead and click on confirm see how is detected this address is unsafe as identified by hash date and i clicked on continue anyway and boom i joined the contract because i wanted to make money yes and they also had their plans so they redrew the money from my account which is the five dollars okay so you can see i've joined the contract again okay so if i was to have any usdt in my account they can also redraw it again so you see because i joined that smart contract there has been deduction in my bnb okay as i say you also have to have bnb in your trust wallet account to make any transaction okay i'll make a video on how to transfer bnb from binance to your trust wallet or from your trust wallet to binance okay so yes let's go to my binance account so that i'll show you the address that i used to transfer my own 15 usdt and also go to revoke and show you the address that they also used to you know transfer money 
from my account so i go to deposit on binance and then i select the crypto that i want to which is bnb smart chain web2 you can see the address it ends in 177719 as we saw in the trust wallet if you can't remember just play back and go and check it out or let me check it for you you can see the address here see meaning i made that transaction myself for the 15 usdt i transferred it myself okay but for the five dollars point i mean minus 5.2375 i didn't do that those people who had access to my account did it i want to take note of that address okay yes so you now you can see that for the 15 usdt i transferred it into my own binance account okay yeah so that's how they you know were able to withdraw money from my account without me knowing i was there i just received a trust wallet confirmation that somebody has you know withdrew the money and i was like how and i just came in and then the money was gone so let me teach you how to revoke it okay when you want to revoke this access to your trust wallet account you just type into your browser allowance dot beefy dot finance okay and then you search for it right allowance dot beefy dot finance that's how or where we can revoke the access okay in you also have to type it into your, your browser okay so you see it is loading and also make sure you select the bnb okay because they have access to your bnb that's when you are doing the smart contract all right so you can see those accounts that have access to my account like you can see it is limited when you are unfortunate and they written unlimited that one i think you are dead because they can redo any amount at any time but this one is limited so i want to show you the authorized spender right authorized spender yes so when i click on that particular address i want you to check the end in those last three and so you can see we have ea573 meaning these people have access to my account and they redo that five usdt from my account without me knowing because they have access to my account through the smart contract that i allowed so anytime you join that smart contract whenever you are there they can withdraw your money at any time at any time without you being aware okay so i'll have to revoke it i'll have to revoke this access because i have to protect my trust wallet so if you want to know how to revoke this access just come to allowance.bfee.finance okay and you can see those there so make sure you revoke them individually so you have revoke then or revoke all but make sure you revoke them individually take your time and revoke it okay yeah so as i said make sure you revoke them individually so let me revoke it and before you be able to revoke you need some amount of bnb in your account so you can see approve usdt okay and you can see the address so they would re they would deduct 0.04 usdt before i can revoke it so you have to have some amount of bnb see it is done and then the second one to click on revoke and then this one you deduct 0.06 usdt and you just approve it okay confirm it and yes it will be revoked meaning they don't have access to your account but before you be able to do that always make sure you have some amount of bnb in your trust wallet before you can because there will be a deduction mostly whenever you are performing any transaction on your trust wallet they actually deduct some amount of bnb so the website or the place that you can do this is allowance.bfi.finance just go to the web browser part of your trust wallet and you type it and you select bnb or ethereum or whatever uh, token that people have access to that it, it is missing in your account and then you know you just revoke that asset so that's basically how to revoke this asset okay do this and just protect your trust wallet account okay because trust wallet is very very good and if if you don't do this they will always be re withdrawing money from your account slowly if the person is smart okay the person can be withdrawing one usdt slowly you dv notice and by the time you realize boom i mean your money is gone so that's basically what happened to me and i hope that you also learn something from it whenever you are joining the smart contract call i mean we all want to make money online but always make sure you do more research whenever you are depositing your money into something okay 
if this is your first time here don't forget to like and subscribe don't forget to share this video to people so that they will become aware of this smart contract scam okay yes i'll be bringing more videos like this more videos to make money online all you have to do is make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification button all right thank you very much i hope this video is helpful always a mistake peace i'm out